the King of Glory, the one who's present in this room right now, the one that looks at you with eyes of fire, of desire, who's moved at the very choice you made to come and worship him today. All the small choices that you make in obedience to him. You know, obedience makes way for blessing. So I just speak forth all the blessings on you. For all the obedience. Just let love arise in this room. Oh Lord, that we may know how much you love us, Lord. How you work all things out for our good. Let confidence arise right now. It's the way you love us, Lord, that transforms our lives. So if you want to be transformed, transformation is the room right now. Let's just open our hearts and ask for it. Holy Spirit, we give you our hearts. We ask that you come and make your home inside of us, Lord. We give you authority into every being of our soul, every part of our soul, every part of our body, Lord. Come and make your home here. Expand inside of us right now, Lord. That we may live from the inside out. Holy Spirit, bring your fragrance upon these people, upon your beloved. That we may know how much you delight in us, Lord. He delights in you. He pours out his love on you. How he loves you. Oh, how he loves you. Let's just allow him to love on us right now. And if you have any doubt, you can ask, God, do you love me? Jesus, how do you love me? What is it about me that you enjoy? What, what about me do you delight in? What part of my personality do you find joy in? Where do you laugh with me? Where do you dance with me? How do I stand in your eyes? How do you see me, Lord? We just acknowledge you, Lord. We allow you to pour your love on us. It just moves us, Lord. You move us. Your goodness is so good. You're so fast. So hard to comprehend, Lord. You're so vast and you're so good. We just love you. We just desire you. We're here because we want more of you, Lord. We invite you here. 